Hi, hello. This is Anup here. And in this video, what we are going to see is Windows 11 domain join process, Active Directory domain join process, right? So let's go to start and go to settings. And in, in settings app, you can see systems. And if you scroll down, you can see about. In the about, there is an option called domain over group. So first of all, there are prerequisites which you need to satisfy before you perform a domain join, right? So there are something like uh, you need to have a valid IP, you need a DNS a details, I'm sorry, DNS server. In that particular DNS server, you should have um, the domain controller details where this client can reach that domain controller. There should be firewall ports open between this, this device PC, Windows 11 PC and the DNS server as well as the domain controller, right? And you should have a domain join account with appropriate permissions, et cetera, et cetera, right? So once you have all those prerequisites, then you can uh, follow this particular process, right? So you can go to domain uh, or work group option over here, right? Computer name, and then click on this one, right? To rename this computer or change its domain or work group, click on change button. I'm going to click on that. Now, this is a work group computer. Now, I want to join this to my lab domain right that domain is basically mmcm.com right that is my domain right so before doing that i just wanted to check whether the domain is reachable from my this device or not let me ping try to ping this domain right and it should be reachable so yeah, it is reachable. That's a good sign. Now let's click on OK. And now I need to provide the username and password, domain join username and password. So let me try to find out domain join username over here. OK, this is the username which I want to try and check whether this is going to work or not. Uh, let me copy the password and click OK. So let's see how this goes. Oh, cool. <laughs> uh, welcome to the domain, mecm.com -E domain. And now I need to restart the VM, right, or device, Windows 11 device to um to complete the domain join process right so that is that is one thing and uh, the other thing which i wanted to show you is if you want to check the log files which are related to domain join if you got some error um in the domain join process you can launch this particular log um from the folder called debug right net setup dot log and you can check what is what is happening there you will be able to check all the processes behind the scenes right so that's that's very pretty good so we, windows debug and net setup dot log okay so that is the log which you need to look into and now we can restart the pc Windows 11 PC by clicking on the yes button and probably that will initiate the restart. After the restart, probably you would be able to log in uh, with the um, domain username and password, right? Now, let me let me connect to the domain with the username and password, right? Sorry, let me connect to that VM, uh, take an RDP of that VM, Windows 11 VM uh using domain uh, domain username and password okay okay that's good sign it's logging into a domain username memcm domain username and password so that means you have already logged in into the domain with domain username and password so let me try to check who am i right and it says okay this user is 
Anub, M E M C M, that is the domain name. Set L, okay. So that will provide you the domain, which is a domain controller which is connecting to. Okay. So that's cool, right? Thank you all for watching. Hope this was helpful. See you next time. Bye bye.